Hey, Kenny. Hey, Kenny. Hey, Mary. Hey, Leslie. Hey, Della. That was a quick ad, Kenny. <clears throat> I hope you're all good. Let me get in the live chat over here. Hello, Robin. Hey, Tracy. Hey, Melody. <clears throat> I hope you're all good. If I cough, I'm sorry. I'm fixing to have to. <coughs> okay. I'm going to try not to do that much. I'm going to try really hard <laughs> not to do that much. Hey, Ruthie. Wilson. I thought I was over it, but... Hey, Ashley. Hey, Karen. Yep, I thought I was over it, but apparently I was not. Anyway. I hope you're all good. We're going to play with some pastel pencils. Hey, Tanya. Hey, Mona. I'm going to wait for a minute because everybody's coming in flying, so... I don't want to miss anybody. So, it's Thursday here. Um, if you didn't know, it may be Friday where you are. It's Thursday where I am. <clears throat> so, anyway, not much has happened personal. Hey, Terry Lynn. Um, just been hanging out. I did work on my um, mermaid a little bit. I did a little bit on her. Um, I did her you know, tail. Um, used gelatos for her tail. <clears throat> I used lemon. Let's see, what did I use? Used the lemon and supernova for her tail. I hope to work on her a little more, maybe today, not sure. But, <clears throat> but yeah, worked on her some. I'd like to get her finished soon. I was in the middle of the night and I don't sleep much anyway, but <clears throat> hey B, but especially when I'm sick I don't sleep well. And um, in the middle of the night I thought, I want her to be yellow and orange. So yellow and orange it is. Hey Rain, if I didn't say hey to you. So, anyway. I may have to hack up a lung again. All right, so we're going to be using these um, soft pastel pencils. I got these for Christmas, and um, we're going to be working with them. The first time I used them ever was yesterday. Again, I decided, hey, I will um, go try those out. So I did, and then I just thought we would we would work on this today. One moment. <coughs> okay. It's really getting on my nerves. I know it's getting on your nerves. Alright. Then you have to wipe the tears out of your eyes and so you can see things. It's all a big fiasco around here. Okay. Um taste is pretty much the same. I can't really taste chocolate now. I could taste chocolate. I think I can taste um, tomato-y stuff, but I'm not sure if it's just my mind playing tricks on me because I know what it tastes on, you know, because I know um, what it tastes like. Hey, Connie. Um, I can't smell anything still, so um, I know. Mona, I'm sorry. It does. Um, yes, cough, cough is a little worse. Um, 
hard to breathe. I don't, I wouldn't say it's hard to breathe. I do get, I do get, um, I guess more breathy if I, you know, do things or whatever, but you know, whatever it is, what it is. Um, I'm trying to make myself do stuff so that I don't just settle. Um, Brian got some more, um, um, Brian got some more medicine yesterday. Um, and he's going to go back, um, Friday for x-rays if he's not better. Um, they didn't like the sound. He may have pneumonia. Um. He does feel better. It's just his, um, he's coughed so much that he's, you know, but they won't do anything for me <clears throat> because there's nothing really they can do for me. Like I don't have, I don't have anything like they can treat, I guess. Like I don't have bronchitis and I don't yet, and I don't have, you know, so it's just fluids, fluids for me. Um, yeah, Della, the, the not being able to smell is, 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 is very strange. Very strange. And like I said, I don't know if I can taste or not. I don't know if it's my brain playing tricks on me or what, but anyway, I'm here. So, you know, it is what it is. I'll be coughing and <laughs> y'all just have to deal with it or, um, you know. Not watch these few while I'm hacking up lungs. Hey, Boots. So, we're going to use these blending tortillions. Tortill to these. Um, for our pastels. Um, one moment. <coughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> so, these do not have colors on them. Um, not sure why they would do that to us, but they do not have colors on them, but they do have numbers. I don't know if any of y'all have these or not. Um, I'm hoping that it's just loosening up, Mona, and it's finally going to do what it's supposed to do. But, you know, and you're worse in the morning than you are in the afternoon, so. Um, of course, yeah, and the coffee's a little worse today, but. We'll make it. We'll press right on. Um, I will say one more thing. My heart, my, my, um, elevated heart rate has been like low. So that's kind of strange for me because I always have a high, I always have an elevated heart rate. I've had an elevated heart rate for as long as I can remember. And, uh, so it's kind of strange that I look and it's like in the seventies or the eighties and but whatever that's where it's supposed to be anyway but I usually have a elevated one so it's kind of strange all right I have picked out three I'll zoom in in just a minute but I've picked out three different type of reds for the petals um <clears throat> oh you're fine um this is let's see seven Monday, seven, eight, nine. This is day 10, I think. Day 10, maybe 11. Since my, since I had a fee, since I had the, but let me tell you what's, let me tell you what's funny. Um, not funny, but not funny, haha. -ha. But they said that you are free to roam. You are free to roam seven days after your last fever. Okay, um, I had a fever one day, one day. Hey, Bev, I had a fever one day, and that was 11 days ago. So, that's why it's spreading, people. That's why it's spreading, <clears throat> is because they tell you you're free to roam. After seven days of a fever, after this, after you haven't had a fever, for seven days. You're free to roam. Yep. Could you imagine me out roaming the streets right now? No. I'm not, uh, uh yeah, not doing it. But yeah. <clears throat> but 
But that's why Brian's at work. Because uh, Brian had a fever one day, and his fever was more days away than mine. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> that's why he's at work. <coughs> and his fast test was negative. But they said, they themselves said that was a lie. But that's why it's spreading, Leslie. That's why it's spreading is because that's why it's spreading so fast is because they've lowered. It was like 14 days or 24 days if you lived with somebody um, that had it and you didn't get tested. And now it's, nope, you go do your thing after seven days. So, I don't know. It's a mess. Okay. So, this is number, are they all the same in the front? Yeah. This one is number five. I don't know. No, these are Cory Nor. Cory Nor. Cory Cory Nor. They're these. Um. These ones. Yeah, those. I got them for Christmas. Welcome back. My nose is itching. All right. So, we're just going to start with, and and with with pastel pencils, let me move all this junk out of the way. Why well, I got so much junk on my desk? I thought I'd clean my desk off. Um, and with pastel pencils, you need to um, work down. Like, if you're, if you're right-handed, work this way. If you're left-handed, work this way. You know, you know how to do. Because they will smear. I do have a piece of, a um, little piece of wax paper. Because I think I want to go in and add a little darker, um, yeah. Yep. I do want to get a little darker, I think, up here. Uh, um, but... I got the wax paper for that so that I don't smear it everywhere. I gotta scratch my nose, I'm sorry. Good gosh. As annoyed as y'all are with me being like this, <clears throat> um, just know that I'm more annoyed than y'all, okay? Okay, so, and for some reason I have hair. And I haven't tried like the erasing effect or anything, but And what I have done is I've just gone in with little, um, like little lines, <clears throat> like so. So, oh, huh. good to know. This is 170. Like I said, I don't know if you'll have these, but this is actually the red color of the three <clears throat> and then we have this one that is 165 thanks Kenny and then I drag it from the top okay and then I just take this little the little blending stump and I start at the top <clears throat> um, with the sharpener Leslie, I'm here for the questions. You can ask me anything. I appreciate the concern. You, um, you can ask me anything you'd like. So, and then something like that. And then I go back with the first color. Um, and then just go around like the edges of it and then I take the blendy stick and I go back now um, you need to layer up with these guys because um, if not you're just gonna get a muddy mess I think they are scratchy like chalk Kenny you wouldn't like them <laughs> sorry <laughs> sorry and I don't know that you can hear that they're scratchy if it bothers you. I'm sorry. I thought about that. Um, I thought about that, but 
I had already decided I was going to do this and uh, so yeah yes I'm very thankful and blessed to have people who care about me yeah because I'm annoyed yeah that's exactly right because it's annoying the fire out of me oh Connie hmm. yes how about it how about it Connie how about it and I haven't seen Brian got these because he thought they looked cool I don't what you know whatever I wasn't expecting these and uh, but Brian got them for me and uh, I was like okay and then I thought am I gonna like those I don't know if I am or not but I, I do I kind of do And like I said, I, I was working on this some yesterday, and then I just thought I would carry it on over so y'all could see them if y'all hadn't seen them. I mean, but y'all see all things that I don't see most of them. And also, um, the Holbeins, is that how you say it, are now available on... Uh, Blick. Don't know if y'all saw that information for the U.S. folks or not. For those who want, have been wanting those, I think um, the big bigger sets are out of stock right now. Um, will be. Um, thanks, Leslie. Will be in um, February before they're back in stock. Just so you know. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Connie may need these. You don't know. She might. All right. And then we're going to go. I'm trying to keep mindful of that so that I do not get my hand in it even though I have this wax paper I hate the way wax paper feels on my hand so and that's all I do boring right I just do a little bitty it doesn't take much at all to do you just uh, I'm just doing little bitty flicks Look, Connie, I can flick with the pastel pencils. Oh, cool. Yeah. This is my first. I have, you know, I have like the pans, but this is my first pen set of pastel pencils. <clears throat> yeah, I'm a little, co I'm a little confused about that, Robin. I'm rain, if I'm, uh, being honest, I gotta get out of the habit. I'm sorry. If I'm being honest, um, because I'm just confused as to why they would make them U.S. only, and they're not a U.S. only company. So I'm a little, a little um, intrigued by that. Because I don't, it makes no sense to my brain. And for them to, um, you know, it was said something about maybe they were trying to be like Prisma. Well, why in the world would Derwent want to try to be like Prisma? Yeah, it makes no sense to me. <clears throat> yeah I, uh, well I get it but why not why strictly I mean I get that but why strictly why not have it you know for everybody especially I mean why not just include us you know why yes Rochelle they are back 
Um, yeah, why, I can understand, like, including us, but why exclusively for us? It's a little, it's weird. <laughs> it's all right. We all have the problem. But yeah, that's what I couldn't figure out, is why exclusively? But, they didn't ask my opinion. Got to figure out how to get these um, books that uh, Connie's all doing. Got to figure out how to get them from the Amazon Japan. Because she refuses to... Uh, Yes, I need it. I need it in my life. <clears throat> hey, Lisa. Oh, welcome, welcome. All right. Like from Blick, Mary, is that what you're talking about, or previously? <clears throat> Like recently or previously? Like from Blick, did you find them in stock on um, the ones you wanted in stock on Blick? <clears throat> Dang, I'm gonna cough again. Ugh. What have you done? Oh, I don't know. Three coloring books that I don't need that I want. You know, that. <clears throat> oh, so she she got them off of Blick yesterday. Okay. No, I was just wondering, because I looked and there was a lot that weren't, uh, I didn't know if you had gotten them previously from somewhere else and you... So you knew you liked them is what I meant. Because I know Tanya don't like them. <clears throat> yeah, so that's what I meant. <clears throat> yeah. Thanks, Connie. I appreciate it so much. Alright, now let's rotate. Nope, let's do it this way. Nope, let's rotate. Where do we want to go next? I don't know. Let's go right here. And then we may have to, um, I may have to work on this flower. Because of my hind position. Yeah, I'm not getting, I'm not getting the whole mind. I have enough pencils done with pencils. <clears throat> the only ones that I may get, possibly, probably not, possibly light fast, but I don't even, I have, I have enough that do anything I need them to do. And that's my new thing for 2021. I know, right, Karen? <laughs> now, if Ink Tense comes out with some new colors, then, then you know, we, we definitely be getting those. But, um, or if, you know, some of the sets that I have come out with more colors, you know, but, um, yeah, I was talking yesterday and I was like, I can't keep up. And it was said, you know, the hardest thing to keep up with now is the budget friendly pencils. Cause they, it's like they've come out of the woodwork and that's true. 
Aw, oh, thanks, Karen. I'm so proud. Gelatos are good. I love them. And I will dare say, you ready for this? I like them better than the Neos. Yep. Lisa, I'm going to be doing my, um, well, I'd already was going to do my coloring book collection video. But yes, I will be purging as well. I will be purging as well. I have too many. I don't use them. My, you know, my style's changed. Um, I have Connie to keep me in the loop of the awesome ones that I need. So I don't have to just willy-nilly buy. Because I have Connie for that. She helps me. Her and Sammy both are the, um, keep me, uh, pretty well in the know. So, I don't have to willy-nilly buy anything anymore. Oh, nice. Yeah, I want the fairy tale book. Okay, so let me see. If I go this way, am I going to hit that flower? Or do I need to go this way? I think I can finish this flower without hitting. I think we'll be in good shape. I just got to turn this way. Let's put this up there just for good measure. I'm not going to touch it because I don't. It drives me crazy to touch it. That's my stomach. You heard it. It hasn't been getting real food lately. <clears throat> um, this is, I think, Nina. And hey, Delbert. Um, this is Nina, 65 pound, I do believe. If not, it is just standard 65-pound um, cardstock. I meant to put that in the description, and I did not. It's either Nina or or that. I switched over mid PDFs so I don't remember or I'd be out of one and not the other. And I don't want to do that until I'm done, do I? Yes. Oh, so, hmm. Yeah, I don't like using them dry, but I must be doing something wrong. I feel like I have to use too much of them, and I'm too stingy. I'm too stingy with them, I think. something else in there. Don't have enough color there. But yeah, it's not a, um, it's 
not a fast process per se. It is uh I have. I have Lisa. I use them sa I use them Saturday is the is the most previous time I used them. I'd use them to do a picture. Uh, I used them to do, let me move some of this junk. I did this picture with them. Um, and then I just went over with a little bit of uh, poly pencil. And then I did this one off camera and I didn't go over it with pencil at all. I just did it. I had I had the colors still on my palette, so I just used them. And then yesterday I did this, not yesterday, I don't know, whatever day. I did this off camera, but um, I did her tail with gelatos, um, lemon, and supernova. So, yeah. I'm going to rotate this here just in case I touch that um, so yeah but thank you I will dare say that I um, am a fan of gelatos I better be because I have a lot of them. And with these pencils, <clears throat> you do not have to put very much pressure at all. Oh, thanks. And I thought about using them today because I do have a hashtag, Gelato's January. And I thought about using them today, but I really wanted to use these today because I wanted to work on this picture. And, and if the scratching gets to be too much, let me know. We can travel on. And that um, mermaid picture is all Faber-Castell products, like uh, the Polly's. Polly's, the Albert Durr, and um, the Gelatos. So, I did mix some pencils, even though I stayed within the same family. Get with it, get with it. And like I said, with these, you just kind of try to layer it up. If it's not dark enough the first time, go back and get it. And make it darker. I'm trying to be really light with it, Kenny. <laughs> I'm trying to be really light with it because I know that it does drive some people batty. So I'm trying not to. Uh, and I also have some paper under it. I'm, I tried to take precautions because I know some people, it's like chalkboard fingernails on a chalkboard so I'm trying to uh, take that into consideration I try to be mindful most of the time I mean there are times that I just you know do my own thing but I try to be mindful And 
And we'll try that, Rain. We'll try that. And just, we'll try that. I don't know. That makes me a little nervous, but we'll try it. I have a water brush right here beside me. I don't let it get too far away from me since we, we lost touch for quite a little bit there a little while back. So I don't let it get too far from me. This is what we're doing. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. So how's y'all's week been? Let's talk about that. How's y'all's week been? Uh, my road's closed for some reason. I don't know what they're doing up the road. Making a lot of noise. I know that. We will test the water theory. I don't know exactly. I will say it makes me nervous. That's the, the garbage man, if you hear them. It is Wednesday. So I, um, I, I finished, uh, I read Matthew McConaughey's book. Um, since we last spoke. Um, so I read his book. Called Green Lights. Um, he's, he's a very philosophical man, of course anybody who has listened to him at all knows that he's very he's a very um, in-depth with his thinking and, and thoughts no I, I trust you I just uh, it, it makes me nervous I can do a trust fall and still be nervous And we're going to do it right here on camera in a minute. <clears throat> but yes, um, I, I enjoyed his book. I wish that uh, he didn't have such potty mouth. But uh, some of his... Some of the things will be written down and, and posted in um, around so I can see them. But yes, um, other than the potty mouth, it was... I'll tell you, um, I can tell you one of the stories out of it. it um, he, they had a pet um, cockatiel, I think. And, um, it was his dad's, you know, favorite, favorite little critter. And they would let him, let it fly loose in the house, you know, he just had full reign of the house or whatever when they were gone or, or whatever. You just had to be careful opening the door. Shake, shake, shake. And, um, you know, they just had to be careful opening the door so they didn't fly out the door. So, um, one day they came home and the bird didn't meet, they would, uh, the bird would always meet his dad at the door, you know, when he came in or whatever. Well, the bird didn't meet, um, the dad. And they found the bird in the toilet, dead in the toilet, where I guess it had fallen in and, um, couldn't get out. So, dead bird in the toilet. <clears throat> And, uh, he, the dad proceeded to pick the bird up 
and perform mouth to mouth on the bird right out of the toilet um, and he did that for quite a you know for a little while and um, brought the bird back to life and I think it said that the bird lived eight years eight years after that so there you go if you give a bird mouth to mouth out of the toilet um, survival rate is um, apparently 100% because that's the only time I've ever heard that so yeah so I was like I'm sitting here thinking to myself you know I like picture the entire thing was like okay bird in the toilet Matthew walks in to his dad giving said bird mouth to mouth and he sees his little a little feather move his little wing move and then and then all of a sudden he hears a chirp and boom yeah no, <laughs> I, cared. I was like okay but it was so I mean it was like oh and then I couldn't even share it with anybody because Brian was asleep and I was like oh the little birdie so So put that in your little bag of tricks if your bird ever falls in the toilet. And of course I'm like, how long has the bird been in there? Has, you know. But there's your little Matthew McConaughey story. <clears throat> Like I said, just keep turning and turning, and we're gonna we're gonna do the water theory, and just we're gonna do that in just a minute. Cause I'm curious to know what it's going to do. However, if I ruin this picture, Robin, I'm coming for you. Not really. I'm kidding. I know. I was like, Leslie. Oh, Leslie. I was like, uh. And I want to be like, did you flush once or did you flush twice? Or, you know, like it was just, uh, I can't, it, the things that I thought about. I mean, it was like, oh, that's so sweet. And it was like, wait a minute. That bird was in the toilet. Now you're nervous. Oh, don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. This is the channel where we try things. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It's all fine. My philosophy of life. It's fine. It's all fine. I feel like I should sharpen this pencil. <clears throat> <clears throat> we'll try it on them blue flowers up there. Hey, Shy. Whoops. It'd be nice if you used the right point. Right hand, right hand, right hand. Okay, okay. Let's see. Boom, 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 boom. I gotta turn again, turn again. Turn again, turn again. I don't even know where to begin. Yep. Homeschooling for you folks. We're back in school over here. Yep. 
next week. Yeah. Maybe. See how long that lasts. So you can get like a <clears throat> gradient looking effect with these. Just got to do uh, your normal layering. Of course, usually I don't do little lines, but I did find that the little lines worked the best for me. Thanks, Tanya. We just winging it, you know. Having a little piddle. But also, I thought that the lines made it look more uh, pedalish, I guess, for lack of a better word. Is that a word? Pedalish? <clears throat> you piddle great. Thanks. I think that means pee in some countries. But. <sighs> okay, Mona, I understand the back. I understand. I got out of... Uh, Helping my daddy this year because, you know, I couldn't go help him. I got out of taking all that down. Moving right along very slowly. I apologize for the wait. But if you will just keep your seatbelt on, we will be done momentarily. I feel like I need to sharpen this, but I'm not going to yet, just yet. So, <clears throat> let's do a, um, let's do a... Question. Question. Coloring book collection. Okay. My coloring book collection. Is that something you would want on a live stream or recorded? I already have a couple people that request it to be live. Okay. So, um, what is your take? And go. Either. Oh, either, either, either. Live, live. Um, I will, um, probably not do flip throughs, but I mean, I'll take, I mean, people ask me questions, they just ask questions. Hey, Patty. Um, I just know that it, um, it would need to be done probably on a Monday because I don't know how long. It's not, look, we ain't Sammy long, um, depending, you know, it depends, but yeah, I mean, people can, it'll be like showing the books and my completed probably completed pages in each book if that is what uh, people want. Um, coloring book collection live or recorded. I've had several people ask me to do it live. 
this time instead of recorded. And then I can just record the supplies, the supply one if I do the coloring book live. And I have to like make out with my pencils and stuff because, you know, I was told that I wasn't um, enthusiastic about my supplies in my last video. So I need to um, take them out to dinner or something. I'm not sure. <laughs> no, I didn't. And, and, and I was called out on it. Like, you know, so I wasn't very excited about my pencils. So I need to make out with them or something. I need to be more excited about them. <clears throat> you know, whatever. Okie dokie. It's my go-to answer. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Welcome back, Connie. I know. I don't know. Is your shaking, is it helping? Can you tell that it's helping yet? <clears throat> oh, Wilson, no worries. You can't tell it's helping yet? Ugh. We like for it to help after day one. Oh, I do. I just make a joke out of it and go on about my life. See, I like when you put the little lines in it that they kind of stay in there. Uh, Murphy has a... Uh, Decided he wanted to come to life outside. And hey, Ray. Um, okay. So I guess we may do that Monday. If I can get my act together. We may, that may be Monday stream. I may come on... Let's see, I may come on, should I come on an hour earlier? What should I do? I gotta get it a little organized. I have books here, books here, books here, over there. I need to go through them a little and cause I'm gonna be purging some of them. Um, I'm sure, I think I may take them to um, not anytime soon, but take them to a local nursing home, perhaps. <clears throat> because um, they love to color and stuff and they don't have, a lot of times they don't have the resources, so. So, I may do that. This rose is taking me forever, and I am sorry for that. We have, um... Probably needs to be the other way, but it's this way now. Well, what I'm thinking is, if I do it on a Monday, I'll have Brian to help over the weekend 
Um, and it's, you know, we're not rushed or whatever. And Brian can help me over the weekend get things um, situated, like put in some kind of order. Like, so I have like all the mythographics or whatever together and stuff like that. Um, yeah. Oh, and he got me um, these 15 foot and 17 foot long coloring books. Yeah, one of them I really like. Two of them I'm a little iffy about. Hey, Evie. Um, this is um, wax paper. And thanks. Glad you weren't here earlier when I was hacking up along. <laughs> I'm trying to keep it at bay. Trying to keep it at bay. Um, coloring book collection. You know, before I add all the ones that you're um, enabling me to get. Yeah, coloring book collection. And I'm thinking Monday, maybe the day. <clears throat> so, we shall see. But, um, several people have come to me and asked if I would do it live. So, we'll see. Like I said, it shouldn't be too, it shouldn't be too long. Oh, cool. Hey, Angela, they have, um, did I, did I read or something that they have like a new formula now with their new ones? Did I read that somewhere? I don't know. Thought I read or was told or something that there's a new formula, adult formula for the Crayolas now. I'm not sure what that actually means, but These pencils, Evie, or the Crayolas? The new Crayolas. Um, these are, um, there's a link for them in the description. I can't remember, 60, 60-ish, uh, 60-ish mm, 60 60, maybe, I don't. Um, and I don't know, I can't, now there are people who can compare them to the other brands here that have them. Um, these are my first, um, go with the pastel pencil. I just, I just got them for Christmas. So I don't know, I don't know like what the, um, you know, like what the, lower brands are compared to the higher brand names. I don't have a clue about that. I know these are the Koei Noi. Um, not bad. Patty, not, not, um, nearly as bad as I thought. They're a little, but not, not bad at all. But I don't, I have a very light hand, so that may be part of it. But no, I don't find them dusty at all. There's, you know, there's a little dust, but I haven't had to um, blow them very much. And the dust only comes when, most of the time when I'm using the blending stump. So, 
Yeah. But I was surprised because I thought they would be, you know, a dusty, dusty mess. I don't know how that's going to go. We're going to go this way with it. We're just going to pick it and go. Night, night, Leslie. Thanks for hanging out. It was good to see ya. Um, hi, Aquarius. How are you? Good morning to you. Sorry, I had my head down. Didn't see you pop in. Uh, if I can ever finish this um, flower, I'm going to put water on it. Not on this one. I'm going to do up there. Up there. Because I want to try to, I'm going to put water on it and then see about going over it. And see how that works. See how that works. I decided to do a few at a time this time. And see. Just throw some of this little light in there. And like I said, I'm doing the little lines because I think it makes the petals look in my mind more realistic doesn't necessarily mean that's the truth and y'all can um, you know y'all do you I definitely want the center to be darker than it is But we will add some more color and make it that way. I've learned that building up color is the best for these. Okay, Melody, I hope you can go to sleep. I'll try not to have any more coffin fits. You'll doze off and I'll get to I'll get to hacking. It happens every night. You have three different, are you, um, I'm not sure, are you talking to me? Oh, 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 gotcha. Um, the, the, I can't say it, Tanya. I was going to do it, but I can't. The, the Dolly, um, 133 is what I use for everything. I almost did, Tanya. I can't do it. Can't. I can't say it like you. Um, the, um, the one that I use is in the, um, description, but it also sharpens oversized pencils too. Like it, it sharpens my brutes. Okay, Della, it sharpens my brutes. And they're square. 
Yeah, my brute pencils are square and it sharpens them perfectly. Oop, I stabbed myself. All right, we need to get this show on the road. I'm almost done with this flower. Phew. Like I said, I probably should sharpen these, this, but I'm not going to just yet. I'll sharpen it before I do the other one. The other flower. Thanks. I kind of like them. Not something I would probably use every day, but I do like them. I am finding that I'm liking water medium a lot. And I'm not sure why. And these are good on the hands too. Like because you're so soft with them. Or I am. I find that they're good. They're good on the hand. Like they don't hurt my wrist. They don't. You know, they're very, they're highly pigmented, so I don't have to uh, worry about that, about not getting enough pigment. Hey, Eskies. Hey, Charlotte. Um, so, thanks. Thank you. I'm going to say, Miranda, that it's all about pressure, not necessarily the pencil. And I have fibro as well. And um, I find sometimes that if I put something on this finger, on this middle finger right here, and my pinky right here, that it helps, um, it helps that sensation. For anybody who has that problem with fibro flares and that happens, I find that if I put something on that middle finger and that pinky, um, that it helps with the sensation. You can wear a brace it. You can wear a brace, um, but I think it a lot of it has to do um, with how you hold the pencil and the pressure that you use. For the pencil. Like sometimes you have to change what you've always done to accommodate your new pain or whatever. I don't know. I do know that that works for my when I have flares because um, for some reason I feel it in my nerves like it's a nerve thing for me a lot of the time so I find that if you put if I put two things then I can help the worst pencils I have for that are um, the polys I don't know um, and I guess the um, the the delis would probably do the same, but I've noticed it with the polys more. So those are the ones, that's the pencils I struggle the most with if I'm having a flare. But, you know, everybody is um, different and has to work it out. To think tomorrow for the crafty part of my channel I think I'm gonna do 
um, cards and envelopes without an envelope maker. I think, um, I think that's what I've decided to do for tomorrow. Of course, those are recorded, but, um, I had a request yesterday morning for an envelope, for a smaller card, an envelope. And so I think I'm going to um, do some envelopes without having to have the envelope maker. Because not everybody has an envelope maker. And I'm going to be doing a series with projects for the envelope punch board, but um, I think I'm going to do some card sizes, some card sizes and some card envelope sizes um, for people who don't have the envelope punch board. I think that's what I'm going to do. We'll see. You know, my mind changes. We're almost done with this rose. Are y'all not so excited about that? It's been a long journey, this rose. Maybe you want to make some Valentine's Day, um, little Valentine's Day cards. Never know. We are on the last petal. And I like that it has variant um, color. Like I may not even go in. I do want to go in and give just a little depth here. Going. I do want to do a leaf or so. We'll have to figure out what leaf would be next in line for me not to hit it with my hand. Although I'm fixing to put water on it, so I'm not going to have that problem anymore. going to add a little depth and you can go back as much as you want and add wherever you think and I think I'm probably going to need to possibly sharpen to get really in those little nukes and crannies but you get the gist okay so Yeah, I mean, I don't know. We're about to see. Okay, so, but is the water, what's the water going to do? You need to find you a valentine. Okay, so it was brought to my attention that I can add water to this, and then I can go back on top of it. Did everybody hear that correctly? Okay. So I'm going to take this water brush. Hi, Brian Allen. I'm going to take this water brush and I'm going to go up here. Wait a minute. First, I need a paper towel. <coughs> First, I need a cough again. First, I need a paper towel. And so I have a paper towel. There's my paper towel. Now, I'm going to take this water brush. And I'm going to, what do you want me to do? This blue flower? Let's do this blue flower. So I just put it on there, right? That's all I do? Where'd she go? Did she leave us? I just put this on there. And we'll see what happens.
Okay. Now what do I do? Wait for it to dry, I guess. So then we just try this leaf over here. I should have did the test to see if it smears beforehand. A little bit. Okay. I knew the the water would set it, but I didn't know I could go over it after the water was applied. So we're just going to apply water everywhere. I will say that it's not moving it, so that's a good thing. That's what I was concerned about. I was concerned that it would move it. But it's not moving it. Did I do this one? I don't even remember. I think I did. So, let's see if it smears in a moment when it's dry. I knew the water would set it, but I didn't know I could go over it after the water. Oh, cool. He is, he is a, um, he's a great Pyrenees border collie. He is a great Pyrenees border collie. Okay, so. Uh-oh. That's still, that's still mirrored. Did I not get enough water then? Green one's still smeared. Hey, purple. Yeah, he's uh, yeah, he's he's as big. He he is big as the Saint Bernard. So if it still smears, does that mean I just I need to add more water? I guess. It means I didn't get the whole thing covered. I don't know. Let's add more water. My um, husband grew up with a St. Bernard. Ooh. That moved a little bit. So the blue didn't smear, the green still does. Um, he doesn't, uh, uh, if you're talking to me, mine doesn't drool. Uh, 
Okay, the blue doesn't smear. The green still does a little. But now let's put, I don't remember what colors I used. I think I used this one. Let's see if we can put, let's see if we can put more on top. Okay, so after putting the water on and putting more on top, it is chalkier. There is more, um, there's more dust. Um, there's more, I, I see more dust after putting the water on and going back over. Feel better, Rochelle. I'm trying to get that, and that's not going to work, so I'm going to take this. Close your ears, Kenny. And let's see. Okay. It does blend back in, but it does have more dust. I never do, Della. Most people do. I never do. Okay, so let's color, let's do some leaves. So with the leaves, I've got several um, different colors picked out. For this, I can't remember what I used for what. Oh, for this I used the darker one. So this is, um, the water does set it. I did put, um, I did put it, put pencil back over. It was dustier on top of the water set. Um, I don't see, I must not have just got enough water on there because now it's not, the, the green isn't smearing either. So, um, so the water does set it, but if you're going to go back over it, um, I did notice that there's more, um, it's more chalkier or no, it's chalkier, not more chalkier. Um, so just keep that in mind. For me, it was chalkier after the, the water was applied. So, just keep that in mind. When you are doing it. And this is number 24 if you have green. If you have green. If you have these, that's the green I'm using right now. And then I'm going to switch to, this is 144. Robin, that's a great tip for, for sealing it for sure. The, um, Like I said, I knew about the water would, you know, would um, settle it down because um, it's pants. I wonder about, I wonder about pan pastels. You think it would work the same way with the pan pastels? Oh, now I'm intrigued. Oh, that's red. Woo -hoo. I mean blue. You think it would work with the pan pastels?
Oh. Well, I was gonna try it. Okay. Hmm. Intriguing, intriguing. Wonder what the difference is. What do you think the difference is? Huh. Yeah, I never do it before pencils. Well, this, it did, Connie, it worked on these. I mean, it, it doesn't smear these. I mean, like, it's, it said it, it don't smear. So that's, I mean, that's interesting. Of course, I didn't try it on the red. I wonder about the red. Let's try it on the red. Let's try it on the rose. Let's just go for it, people. Let's just go for it. Are we ready? Go for it. Let's just, let's put this here because I don't know if I'm going to be touching that one I didn't seal. So let's just do it. Make sure we get good coverage with it. Make sure you get enough on there. And let's just go for it. What's the worst that's going to happen? I'm going to mess up these pretty roses. It'll be alright. You know what's a good thing about a PDF? You can reprint it. Oh, and the link to um, this packet is in the description as well. And while I'm doing this, if you have um, a channel that you would like to um, promote, just put up three emojis of some sort and people write it down and after the stream you can go and check them out. It's moving these a little bit, probably from where I didn't get it smeared in very well. But yes, if you have a channel, um, do it. Also, if you have a um, hashtag for January, you can go ahead and plop that in there. Connie comes up after me. She comes on in an hour and a half. And that is CB Coloring and Crafts, if you do not know. And if you do not, if you're not subscribed to her, you really should be. And there's a siren, so if you hear a dog's howling, then um, that's why. I think I'm peeling the paper. Okay, we're gonna let that sit for a minute. And uh, sorry that they're howling, but they don't like the sirens. Did I do this one or no? Nope, I did not. Um, 
So you just make sure you get it completely covered with water. It does move a little if you haven't blended it in. Which doesn't bother me because it give it a more blended look. Be careful with the water because it will make your paper peel. So there's that. Are we dry? Are we dry? Can't tell. Okay, I don't think it's smearing. Now, I would not personally, I would want to be done before I put the water on. Hey, Shell. I would want to be done. Um, are you stream? Do you stream today too, Shell? Um, I would want to be done um, before I put the water on, I think. I would want to be done. Okay, so let's do some more Let's do some more of this while that one is drying. And then I'm going to put some more on top and just see if that is um, as chalky as the blue was after the water. Because before the water, they're not that chalky at all. But after the water, thanks. Um, but after the water, it was a little chalkier. So we will see how that red does. Blend this around. <clears throat> a little like that, a little bit. All right, are you dry? Are you dry? All right, so I'm going to take the middle one and I'm going to go back up here. I'm going to put this here because I haven't done anything with that rose. But I'm going to go back up here and we'll just see. Um, we'll just see. Let me sharpen this a little bit. Hey, PJ. And I, after I sharpen it, I do take um, sandpaper because it has like a silver ring around it after I sharpen it because of the sharpener. Does that make sense? Like the sharpener puts like a silver ring around it. So I just take a little bit of sandpaper and sand that off a little bit. So I'm going to go back in and we'll just see if it's chalkier or not. And just add a little some detail. the paper right there because I set the water brush there too long. Let's see if we can fix that. Roll Tide! 
Roll Tide. So, it's not uh, too bad. Not too chalky at all. And it's just the blue was the I'm going to go back with my little blending stump in a minute and see if it'll blend, you know, if it won't be so harsh. But yes, I knew the water. I did not know I could go back over it. I thought that was it. Done. Not this time. <clears throat> so you can go back in. I'm going to call. One moment. <coughs> Hey, Cassie. So, go back in. Do a little more right there. And then we're going to take the blending stump and blend it out some. See? Blends. Now my paper has buckled because, well, I did use water, but that buckling doesn't bother me. It bothers a lot of people, though. You'd be surprised at the people it bothers. It doesn't bother me. All right, so let's take and this. I'm trying to do it quietly. I'm trying to do it quietly. Alright, so we got that cleaned off. And now I'm going to see about blending this out just a little. I don't want to blend it out a lot. But and see if it'll if it sits on top. Like if it if it'll sit if it sits on top, blend it out. Since that bottom layer is fixed. Mm. Probably so. Okay. It does sit on top. So. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I was, I had, you know, I had plans of going back um, and trying to add more depth, but I wasn't sure about 
if I had to do it before or after. So thanks for the tip. Thanks for letting me know that I could do it before. <laughs> get over it, get over it. Embrace the buckle. Yes, embrace the buckle. Like embrace the white, embrace that buckle. I like it. I don't like it when it curls. I mean, you know, the curling bothers me, but the buckling doesn't bother me. I like it. It makes me feel like an artiste. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I like it. Okay. All right. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. While we're here, let's add some, let's do something up here with these uh, leaves and see if it's chalky. Now, I, d I don't, uh, I didn't put water on that, so um, so um, I need to remember that, that that will smidgey smidge. Absolutely agree. Gosh, I'm so lazy though. Yeah, I'm so lazy with that fixative business. I shouldn't be that way. Maybe I'll be better this year. Probably not. But now, with that being said, I would more than likely n not worry about using them in a coloring book. Knowing that I can do that water thing um, and go back over it, I might would use them um, in a coloring book. Huh. Good to know. Yeah, that's good to know. Appreciate that little tip. Y'all, we learned something here. Thanks, we learned something here. We never learn things here. Get off. I need to buy stock in these these things. Oh gosh, see, and here's the problem. I thought I was almost done with this page and now I know that I can go do all this stuff. Now I'm like, hmm. Cause y'all know me, I'm the watercolorist that, that tries not to go over, um, go over it again <laughs> with pencil. I like to just let it be. That's, that's all right. So we can do, we can go ahead and water her down and water that and that down. Cause I've done all the other, right? Yep. Yeah, and it doesn't smear. <laughs> Good to know. So we can water this. Like I said, I knew about the the water would settle it, but I did not know I could go back over it. I don't know why. Yeah, but with pan pastels, 
they smear you can spray them like I've sprayed them and they they still smear all over the place I don't know I'm gonna have a bunch of this makes me want to do another pastel uh, hashtag thanks I need to be like Sammy and tape it down be like Sammy and tape it down she tapes hers down she she don't like that buckling either So maybe that's what I should do. Oh yeah, mine smear all over the place. Yep. Yep, mine do all over the place. I sprayed them two or three times. And they smear all over the place. Steel. So maybe I will say I do like these. I like the colors. So Brian did good. Oh, you would be amazing with pans. So what did y'all do today? Oh, I just watched Shannon put water on some pan pastel, I mean on some pastel pencils. It was a fun time had by all. I don't know if I got all that. I got out of my rhythm. Now I'm going to sing Johnny Cash for you. No, I'm not. I'm going to refrain. If I get to singing, I'll get to coughing. We don't want me to be coughing. I've done pretty good keeping it at bay today. Go ahead and fix all of it, and then <clears throat> I'll let my water brush has decided that it finally wants to give me some water. I love these water brushes, though. These are my favorite water brushes. I didn't put a link in because, well, I didn't know I was going to be using water brushes. I should put a link for everything that I use in, ever, and just save it, and then I don't have to do it every time. But I have to switch it from craft stuff to this stuff. To coloring, to crafting to book stuff all right um we're done with the water brush for a moment okay it is buckling a little bit
Yep, that's them. That's them. I like them. I don't even think I put these tortillion things in. Okay. Are we done? Are we done for the day? Um, I just got an alert that there's a um, yard flamingo on sale on Amazon. I'm not exactly sure why I was alerted of a yard flamingo. Now, when that dries, I'll go back and... I thought I was going to finish this page. I will go back and do... Add some more little details into that one. I think. I really like... I, I don't know if I will or not. Because I kind of like how it's all... Whatever. I don't know. Anyway. Let me zoom out. Let me zoom out. Um... Zoomy, 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 zoomy. Okay. So, any coloring is where this came from. And also where this one came from. And this one came from. Um, are you um, streaming, Shell, did you say today? After Connie? Connie's on in an hour and an hour. Okay, so let me show you this real quick. So I got some, okay, so I got some, um, I got some PDFs, uh, that I want to share with you, but I can't remember who they are, so maybe I do not need to share them right now because I did not write down their names. Well, poo. So, I won't share them now because I didn't write down their names to some of them and I have drawn a blank because we'll blame COVID. Okay, and then this little lady, I hope to try to finish her. Um, we're using Faber Castell um, products for her Gelatos for the tail and Albert Durer's and Polly's. Um, what else? Is that all? Is there anything else you need um, to ask me before I hop off and go get me some hot chocolate? Yes, Con Connie, don't you stream today? Don't you stream today? Yeah, in an hour. She, you're in an hour, right? She's on in an hour, I'm pretty sure. Okay, and then after her is Shell. Uh, anything else? Y'all think of anything else y'all need from me? Now, we will, we will say Monday that I will do my coloring book collection. Now, finally, let me tell you. Finally, I do believe that I have the community post option. Finally, I think it has shown up. Um... I will um, let you know there if I'm going to be on earlier or um, what. If not, we will um, just bank on my usual time, which is 11 Central Time on Monday. Um, like I said, it should not be a very long stream. It may be longer than normal. Um... But we will we'll bank on, on doing the color and book collection on Monday. If I don't do an impromptu on the weekend. If Brian's up for it, we may impromptu on the weekend so that um, so that he's here to help. So we'll see how it goes. Thank you so much for your concern. I appreciate it. Um, see you in a little bit, Connie. Um, I appreciate your concern. Thank you very much. And um, I think I've done pretty good keeping the cough at bay. Hey, Oreo. And I will see y'all in Connie's in a little bit. I'll see you back here on Monday. And uh, we'll go through some coloring books. Okay? Be kind to one another. 
make someone smile, and I will see you later. Thanks for hanging out. Bye, guys.